The U.S. Justice Department has found evidence of racial bias at Ferguson Police in Missouri, U.S. media report. The agency is expected to accuse the department of conducting stops without reasonable suspicion and making arrests without probable cause. It began a civil rights investigation following the August shooting of Michael Brown. A white police officer killed the unarmed black 18-year-old, sparking protests in Ferguson and nationwide. A separate report is expected to clear the officer, Darren Wilson, of any civil rights violations in the shooting of Mr. Brown. Officials announced the findings by speaking anonymously to various U.S. media. An official announcement is expected on Wednesday. It is believed that report will accuse the police of using excessive force against blacks and present evidence that black motorists are stopped and searched much more often than white drivers despite the fact that white drivers are more likely to be carrying contraband. It will also allege that blacks are 68% less likely to have their cases dismissed by a judge, and that 95% of people kept at the city's jail for more than two days were black, as it presents direct evidence that officers and court workers engage in racial bias. Investigators found that officials used money from fines to help balance the city's budget, the New York Times reported. Attempts to seek comment from the police department and city government were not successful. A spokesman for the Missouri governor said, We haven't seen the report to be able to comment on it. The Justice Department could file a civil rights lawsuit, if officials do not settle the claims out of court. The protests about police use of force were reignited when a Missouri state grand jury did not recommend charges for Mr. Wilson. Shortly afterwards, President Barack Obama said the protesters' frustrations, have deep roots in many communities of color who have a sense that our laws are not always being enforced uniformly or fairly. The civil rights investigation was announced in September 2014 by Attorney General Eric Holder, the Justice Department's first black leader. In October, he said the Ferguson Police Department needed wholesale change.